Hi guys, and welcome back to our channel. I am very sorry to start this kind of vlog halfway through the trip, but it has been the most crazy and manic two weeks. So basically we're in Cornwall. I'll kind of pin on the screen kind of where location area we're staying. It is beautiful. Unfortunately, the weather is pretty wet and rainy, but we make the most of a bad situation. Monday we arrived and we kind of just stayed in, cooked dinner and opened all our wedding cards and gifts and just chilled because we literally got married on the Sunday and then drove like six hours to get here. So we're just kind of relaxing. Yesterday I will put on the screen a selfie of where we were, which was Sharp's Brewery. That was a tasting, tasting session and then we also took Kaiser for a lovely walk locally. And then today we were meant to go to the Tinder Girl, I don't know how to pronounce it, Castle, but that got rained off due to extreme um, wind and rain. So we are now going to a local little nature reserve for today and we kind of swapped our whole week plan. So I will keep you posted and I will kind of start to properly vlog from today. <laughs> Probably. We have managed to walk all around for about an hour or so. It's quite slippery, but we're just keeping Kaisy on lead, off lead, depending. It's quite a few people. It has finally stopped raining, which is really nice. Shay did forget his waterproof, which is quite annoying. But yeah, um, it's beautiful. As you can see, I'm probably here in the background. Obviously, I'll put loads of clips in from today and what it's called. But yeah, we're gonna keep rumbling and see what we find. He's all confused. good morning guys so i basically forgot to finish the uh, little bit of segment of vlog last night with us going to the kind of little river and stream it was beautiful today um it's thursday i've lost track of my days no Thursday? Wednesday? I can't even remember. I don't even know what day of the week it is. But we are at Polly Joke Beach this morning. And then we're going to another beach um, later on for some lunch and kind of early dinner, which I can't wait for. The weather is absolutely beautiful today. We did swap around our plans to kind of fit around the weather. But Kaiser loves a good beach. We can have his frisbees and everything. So fingers crossed we have a good day. No, so Hi.
Look at you, Sandy Puppy. We have come to the other beach at Newquay. We made Cornish pasty. Your mare, your mare. Look how handsome my boys are looking. <laughs> Yummy. The beaches are so cute. I have a restaurant booked for like lunchy dinner at like two-ish and I can't wait. And it is beautiful, two beaches. The other one, what was it called? Jolly, Holly Joe? I can't remember. It'll have it all vlogged. And then this is like the Nuki Fistral Beach, which is like the most popular one in the area. But the weather is superb and it's lovely just to be out and relaxing to be honest so yeah if you have any recommendations let me know down below so we've got Kaizi and I have spotted a Newfoundland look how beautiful I've not seen a lot of large black doggies around here so it's nice to see a lot of server surfers a lot of doggies more doggies it's definitely got quieter since we've been here but no it's gorgeous We have just left our honeymoon location and we are on our way home and we have detoured to a dog friendly zoo. Surprisingly, there's quite a lot of dogs here. You keep them on short leads and you don't go indoors. So I'm gonna vlog this because I'm so excited. So yeah, where are we? Let me show you. Cotswold Wildlife Park Garden Centre. Um, I think it's like 16 or 17 pound each. And then we got a little kind of guidebook for 250 so yeah i can't wait this is gonna be such a, a nice end to our trip and also the weather is beautiful so yeah let's bring you along Cats. Very cute. They all ran over to say hello to Kaiser. Really? I was, no, I was going to sit on the freezer. We have just found the prettiest, what is it, manor house. Look at that. 
I just got some photos in front of it because it is so cute. We've seen lots of monkeys and birds and we also met another German Shepherd puppy. Look at the pretty rhinos. Not interested. That's it, look at you rhinos. They are so cute, aren't they making noises? Go make an impression of a rhino. It's more interested in food. <laughs> Bring in the goods. <laughs> Got a happy baby. Yay. Oh, looks good. Thank you. Right. I did not plan <laughs> with ending this video like this, but we're home and we're settled now from Cornwall. I didn't really say kind of how the day went for our wedding. Um, I might do a separate video about talking about that, about getting um, Kaiser organised and there for the day. Let me know if you'd like a separate video, but sorry, now Kaiser has decided to have a drink. but basically we went to Cornwall and it was beautiful I did explain that we swapped our plans around to suit the weather it was beautiful I kind of just jumped from day to day I didn't really close each day so we got there Monday evening and we left Saturday um, early morning but we ended up going to like a dog friendly zoo um, on the way home which you would have all seen but it was beautiful. We booked our little cottage on Holiday Cottages. Um, it was a bit pricey, but it was like a three bed detached cottage, which beds, I think, six people or sleeps six people. So because it was just between us, obviously it cost a bit more. It's like 20 pound to have just um, like Kaiser as an extra charge, but it was stunning. Um, beautiful big garden. I'll put that on the screen now and it was fully secure with a gate which then led to the alpacas which was our neighbours so basically the lady who owns the cottage lives like next door in her own home which is completely detached she's lovely they gave us a beautiful basket then i'll put on the screen a beautiful basket um for our engagement because she didn't even our oh, engagement um, our marriage um, and our honeymoon she didn't know I didn't say anything and then she knocked to see if we got there all right and settled in I said yes and um, she was surprised it was just us two and I explained why and she thought that was very sweet um, and yeah it was a gorgeous trip I'm so happy um, that we went away straight away and um, especially with Kaiser loads of people be like he looks amazing he looks incredible he does like he's really playful and cheerful but he wore himself out he was barely on leave for the whole trip and oh, look at him he's all been snuggly he's been super snuggly but he has now been paying the price of it running around lots jumping around lots he was pushing himself like he was at like lake district or norfolk years ago and i'm like boy you don't do this anymore <laughs> And by the end of it, I didn't film it, but he was struggling to walk up the stairs in the cottage and the stairs in the garden. Some nights he just stayed downstairs, which was so unlike him because he wants to sleep next to us. We didn't let him on the furniture or bed or anything, which I requested, which was fine. But it was like self-catering, but to be honest, we barely took food. We normally cook a meal like every night in. I thought it was a honeymoon, so we went out for dinners, lunches and... It was gorgeous we went to like a caribbean kind of pirate theme everything was dog friendly so i would recommend we went to the most beautiful castle and rivers and streams and yeah it was gorgeous so thank you for everyone who wished us um and i will put in a couple uh, wedding photos um now so kaisi did attend the wedding and he was gorgeous if you follow us on instagram you would have seen this so i will link our instagrams on now but it was just such a fantastic day, but it went so fast. 
So yeah, we had a brilliant trip and I would have obviously linked all the dog friendly zoo that we went to, which was amazing. And also Kaiser was so well behaved, like there were so many children. Just right at the end, a little girl was like, I want to go and stroke your dog and went to run. And I just went, no, like I put my hand out. She was still quite far, but I was like, putting that safe barrier. She went, oh, and then went wah and cried. And I was like, no, my dog is literally the same height as her like sitting down i can't risk him reacting and something happened and her getting nipped on the face or or bumped into him or scratched by accident or just in general like she might be allergic i don't know i can't risk it and the parents were like oh thanks i was like just be aware like there is a lot of dogs and it was quite busy because the weather was surprisingly nice and they're like oh yeah that's fine thanks but i was like oh whew, we live to fight another day i well, he's nine. The crazy fact that I'm saying that my dog is nine and he's like getting older is terrifying. Um, and Kai's is now having to go to the vets to sort some pain management out along with his hydro because of how far he's pushed himself in general and recovery from his op. But I'm rambling. But yeah, no, thank you so much. We have finally hit 300 subscribers. I'm not gonna do a, a crazy video for it or a thank you because we've hit this a lot quicker than I expected and also I've just been busy with life I'm sure everyone else has so thank you so much for watching it is autumn and Halloween nearly so we have a very cute Halloween vlog coming along which will be filmed on my birthday um we're filming that on the 19th of October so that will be out very soon but I love my pumpkins if you can see them <laughs> and candles so yeah if you love autumn let me know in the comments or let me know your favorite season so i'm just rambling sorry have a lovely evening or morning or wherever you are in the world thank you so much for watching and subscribing and if you haven't subscribed subscribe already and have a lovely day bye